This video will explain how to apply for a Google Apps for Education account. When you apply, Google creates an enterprise account, which is a business account. To apply, type google.com into the address bar of your web browser. Search for Google Apps for Education. Click, select the official site. Click Get Apps Today. Complete the sections titled About You and About Your Institution. So I'm going to type in my name and my work email and my institution name. You can type in your school. Select the type of institution. Type in your work phone number. Click Next. Read what is a domain anyway. A domain can host your school's website. You must use an original domain. If your school's website address has a slash, it's not an original domain. If your school's web pages are part of the Washoe County School District website, then the web page addresses will contain a slash. If your website has a slash in it, you have to select Buy a New Domain Now. The cost for a new domain ranges from about $8 to $12 per year. If you don't have your own domain, Google will give you a domain. You can select from the drop-down menu a .com, which is $12 per year, a .net, which is $10 per year, or a .org, which is $12 per year. Those are the most common. If your school's website doesn't contain a slash, you may click Use a domain name I have already purchased. There will be no charge for using your own domain. I'm going to use my own domain and I'll type it in here. Click Next. Type your username. Type your password twice. At the bottom of the page, type the text that you see. Then at the very bottom of the page, click I have read and agreed to the Google Apps for Business Agreement. Finally, click Accept and Sign Up. Google will send you an email after they create your new account. Be sure to keep the email for your records. It will contain important information. Once you have your new Google Apps for Education account, please remember you can set up Google Apps so that students cannot use email or so that they can only email the teacher and can't email outside of the domain. Groups of students are called organizations. You may want to have an organization for each grade level. You can turn the various apps on or off for different organizations. 